Writing Effective Paraphrases Paraphrasing means to say or write something in your own words. You convey the meaning of someone else's words by accurately restating them using different words and sentence structures than the original. When you paraphrase, remember these points. Convey only what the original says. Do not add your opinion. Vary word choice and sentence structure from the original. Restate accurately what the original says. Do not change its meaning. Properly document your paraphrases. Putting something in your own words still requires giving credit to the author. If a word or phrase cannot be paraphrased, you may use exact words from the original, but be sure to place quotation marks around them. A paraphrase is not a summary. It can be as long as or even longer than the original. Let's read the following four examples, then read the explanation as to whether the paraphrase is acceptable or not. Example 1. It is a truism of New York life that the city never sleeps, and night revelers can be assured that somewhere something is going on, no matter what the hour. Paraphrase. In New York, there is something to do all hours of the night. Is this paraphrase acceptable? Yes, this paraphrase is acceptable. Word choice and sentence structure are different from the original, and the meaning is intact. Example 2. Queens is the largest borough in area and the second most populous. Paraphrase. Queens is the biggest borough in area and the second biggest in number of residents. Is this paraphrase acceptable? No, this is not an acceptable paraphrase. Although a couple of words have been changed, largest to biggest, the sentence structure is nearly identical to the original. Example 3. While individual industries have undergone cycles of rise and fall, New York's position as the United States corporate headquarters remains intact. Paraphrase. New York has seen its stature as the nation's corporate headquarters diminish. Is this paraphrase acceptable? No, this is not acceptable. Although the sentence structure has been changed, the meaning of the original is not intact. The original states that New York is still the nation's corporate headquarters. Note that corporate headquarters is in quotation marks because it is quoted directly from the original. Example 4. The city is divided into five districts called boroughs. Each of these boroughs was a separate county until 1898, when the Bronx, Brooklyn, Staten Island, and Queens were incorporated with Manhattan to form New York City. Paraphrase. In 1898, New York City was created by the consolidation of five different counties, which were renamed boroughs. Today, Manhattan, Queens, the Bronx, Brooklyn, and Staten Island are the five boroughs that make up New York City. Is this paraphrase acceptable? Yes, this paraphrase is acceptable. Word choice and sentence structure are different from the original, and the meaning is intact. You have completed this activity on writing effective paraphrases.